I believe that estrogen has been given a bad rap, that the world tends to think of estrogen as what makes us emotional. But I'd like to rebrand estrogen and say that her superpower is that you are keenly psychic and intuitive when she comes in because you need to be to make a, the right decision for you on who you're going to reproduce with. And go ahead. I can it's tell you no, what to say. Oh, I'm freaking out. It's no accident. I say this to clients as I draw out for the hundredth time, which I love. My cute whiteboard over here has seen the female cycle thousands of times. And it's no accident, I say, that the height of estrogen coincides with the beginning of ovulation, right? Yeah. That mental acuity around the time that your libido is firing up means your brain is being bathed in mental acuity. And so you have the, the bandwidth and the fortitude to make big, amazing, creative decisions. Yeah. And I fully agree with that. The fact that our biochemistry is designed to make sure that when we are ready to reproduce, we are also at the height of our capacity to think for ourselves. Yeah. And I think that estrogen is an extrovert, that she makes us go with outside of ourselves because that's what she's trying to do is scan the environment for reproduction. And when that goes away during menopause, it's an invitation to stop looking outside yourself for the answers. As estrogen diminishes, you now have an opportunity to go within. And when we look at even things like, and I'm not anti-HRT, but when we look at this like continual discussion about we need more estrogen, we need more estrogen, I would agree we need a appropriate estrogen. But the goal is not to bring back the estrogen of 35. The goal is in the 55 and 65 year old body to learn to navigate your own life and your own mind with a more internal lens, not an external one. Yes. And how cool is it that we have the capacity to always to revisit that convergence between the outer and inner knowing? Because the more consistently and bravely and precisely you follow that inner knowing, yes. the more precise and beautiful your outer world becomes. Yes. It's yeah. a reflection of that inner knowing. 